contemporary healthcare faces challenges, such as limited number of doctors, including specialist doctors, overcrowded hospitals and clinics, an aging society. The solution to these problems is MediHelp, a system that allows patients and their doctors to monitor the cases from their own homes. This ensures that patients are admitted to the hospital when their condition requires it. Doctors stress that many patients arrive at health facilities too late, making their treatment less effective. In addition, the technology enables voice or video contact between the patient and the specialist. This possibility eliminates the problem of doctors' availability in smaller towns far from large agglomerations. Examples Ms. Barbara suffers from chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. It is a condition that causes a developing reduction in airflow through the airways. If left untreated, the disease wreaks havoc on the body. Changes in the lungs and hypoxia in the brain. We can limit the development of this disease by pharmacological means. The progress of change should be monitored on an ongoing basis. This is done using a spirometer, a pulse oximeter and a stethoscope. Ms. Barbara has the MediHelp app on her smartphone. All three diagnostic devices needed to monitor Ms. Barbara's health have been paired with the phone via Bluetooth technology and are sending Ms. Barbara's results to the system. Monitoring saturation levels or the saturation of arterial blood with oxygen is crucial in cases of lung disease. A below normal result may indicate a worsening of the patient's condition and the need for hospitalization. It's very simple for a patient to use a pulse oximeter. The patient places the device on a finger. The results of the measurement, which takes about 30 seconds, are sent automatically to the monitoring center. If the patient does not have a smartphone, the measurement results can be entered via a web application or dictated to a bot on an automated hotline. Ms. Barbara also requires constant auscultation of her chest and back. This is where an electronic stethoscope helps. The app shows the patient the areas on the body where they should place the bell. The examination requires auscultation of the patient's front and back, so a second person is needed to perform the examination. The results are delivered as audio files to the monitoring center. If the recording shows anything of concern, Ms. Barbara will be called by the medical center to determine the next steps. A spirometer test is a measurement of the volume of air exhaled from the lungs and its flow rate during inspiration and expiration, allowing the assessment of lung ventilation. Ms. Barbara's spirometer works on the same principle as the one in her doctor's office. The difference is that Ms. Barbara blows into the mouthpiece of the spirometer while sitting in her favorite chair. As soon as the test is completed, the app sends the results to the medical center. The spirometer also measures blood saturation. Patients who are instructed by their doctor to measure both air volume and saturation can have both tests performed with a single device. Mr. Tomas has been suffering from diabetes for years. He's under constant medical supervision. It is possible to live with this civilization disease for many years, but it requires discipline in terms of diet and regular monitoring of blood sugar levels. Since Mr. Tomas started using MediHelp, entering his results from a blood glucose meter, his doctor has real-time access to his blood results. No pairing of the diagnostic device with the phone is required for the meter. The result of the test is given by the patient directly in the application. Mr. Andre is 70 years old and suffers from high blood pressure. He is independent and manages perfectly well on his own with everyday household activities. His children often visit him with his grandchildren, but he's been living alone since his wife's death. Mr. Andre's doctor advised him to have his blood pressure measured at least twice a week. After taking a blood pressure check, Mr. Andre enters the measurement from the manometer into the MediHelp app, which sends it to the medical center. Hypertension is often accompanied by headaches and dizziness, which in extreme cases can lead to loss of balance and falling. Mr. Andre's children encouraged him to start wearing a telemedicine wristband. 
Thanks to the wristband, the doctor can remotely monitor Mr. Andre's heart rate and saturation. The device is equipped with an accelerometer that detects when a wearer falls. The system automatically sends a notification about such an event. The wristband also enables making a voice call to a previously indicated person, even if the dangerous situation happens during an afternoon walk. This is possible thanks to a built-in SIM card. The connection is established by pressing a button on the wristband, which also triggers an alarm signal. MediHelp solutions benefit patients and healthcare entities. The ubiquity of smartphones means that for patients, the service has virtually no technological barriers. With MediHelp, hundreds of thousands of patients can be monitored, hospital bed occupancy can be reduced, and diseases can be diagnosed with greater precision through a more detailed and more frequent collection of test measurements. Hollow Formed specialists are constantly developing the solution by adding support for more diagnostic devices.